Welcome everyone to an analysis of the Quaddy this Saturday night at Cannington. Race 5 is the first leg. It's the country championship final where the four best northern representatives clash with the four best from Mandra. Let's have a look at it. Race 5, we've got Dula in box 1 representing northern, also representing the Avon Valley region, Natural Element, Lachico and Sandy's Jack. Interesting that the northern dogs have the odd boxes the Mandra dogs have the evens, namely Rebel Rebel, Miss Hepburn, Twang Star and Octane Show. Let's have a look at the early speed. I know there's plenty of it in boxes one and eight. Dula with a huge red skyscraper there and uh, she'll be hard to cross, although Octane Show with a pretty tall pink building there as well, expected to challenge at the first turn. To the winning probability percentages, Dula with a massive 30, given a huge chance to win for Northam. And Octane Show with 31. So Octane Show favoured, but only just over Dula for the North for the uh, Country Championship final of 2009. Moving on to race six, which is the second leg of the Quaddy. Insurgent is on a winning streak. It's up in grade though. It's drawn box one. Heart of Badiris is a very talented type coming back from Queensland. Galactic Rose also a chance with early speed. To the early speed charts. And by the look of that, it's hard to predict who's going to be in front. There's early speed in boxes 1, 2, 6, 7 and 8. Possibly 6 galactic rows to find the top of the first turn. To the percentages now, an insurgent well rated with 24. Heart of Badiris, 29. And galactic rows is on the third line there with 21. Moving on to the third leg now, a canning stake over 530 metres. And Xanadu Spirit, a recent Mandra winner, has won. Jerry the Jet, Fantasy Manelli, both fast beginners. Plethora ran a good second here last Saturday night. To the early speed, and there's not much in box two there. In top gear, expected to drift back. Big skyscraper there for Jerry the Jet from box four. He's the expected leader. And just looking at that, possibly three Fantasy Manelli to settle second at the first turn. Now, winning percentages. Xanadu Spirit in top gear in boxes one and two, given a show. Fantasy Manelli, 21. Jerry the Jet with 28, and he is the highest rater for the third leg of the quaddy. Now to the final leg, and Lucky Louie looks awfully hard to beat off the inside. Bertie Sinet, an impressive last start winner. Maestro Fletch was outstanding at Northam on Monday. He ran a quick time, and he ran down a good dog too. Interesting to see how he goes this Saturday night. To the early speed, and there's toe in boxes one, three, and four, and that's just about it. Bertie Sinet did sizzle to the first turn at last start. Maybe Bertie will lead on Saturday. Now to the winning probability percentages. Lucky Louie's on top. Big slice of red pie there for Louie, 29. Maestro Fletch with 13, Micromiss 14, and Bertie Sinet 19. All right, let's have a look at my quaddy suggestion. This will cost you $40. Now, I reckon Dula's going to win race five. I'm not sure why. Dula did get a little bit tired in its heat at Northam on Monday, but her early speed is blinding. And if Octane Show doesn't ping, I think Dula's going to pinch this. So I'll stand her out. Number one in the first leg. Second leg, numbers one, two, five, and six. Third leg, one, two, three, four, five. Fourth leg, one, three, four, six. That will set you back $40 for the 50 cent unit. Frisbee. The animated dog, as you can see on screen, for the $48 investment. First leg, numbers one and eight, Dula and Octane Show. Second leg, one, two, six. Third leg, one, two, three, four. Fourth leg, one, two, three, four. That'll set you back $48 for the 50 cent unit. If you're having a quaddy this Saturday, the best of luck. Don't forget, race three Saturday night is a quartet jackpot race.